Amen. Praise the Lord, New Horizons Church family and friends. This is Pastor Wiggins, and I greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Today is day number 20. This is the day that we are praying through Psalm 23 and verse 6. We're on day 20, Psalm 23 and verse 6, and it reads, Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. As we're on day 20, we're going to be praying that last part of the Psalm 23 and verse 6 that says, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. What a privilege it is to be able to call upon the name of the Lord and know that when we call upon the name of Jesus, we are saved. And when we make a confession of our faith upon the death, burial, and the resurrection of Jesus, um, we are saved forever. And we can claim this promise uh, with the psalmist here today and with all everyone else who's ever called upon the name of the Lord, that we will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. And so what a wonderful um, promise of security and salvation that we find here in the scriptures today. So today we just want to pray and thank God that we are part of his holy household. That we are part of his holy house. So when we're part of the household, and we're part of his house. We are safe from whatever enemies, and whatever evils and whatever other demonic and satanic efforts to take us out are on the outside. We know that we are a part of the household and inside the household of faith and God's house. And so that is something that we can take and be confident in each and every day for I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Come on, let's pray and just thank God for his eternal security in his name. Father, in Jesus name, what a day this is. This is the day you've made, oh God, we are rejoicing. We are glad in it. Thank you for the privilege and the power of prayer. Lord, I thank you for partnership in prayer with so many people who are praying alongside of us and praying with us. And we're praying according to Psalm 23. Thank you for leading us through this psalm the last 19 days. And thank you for leading us now here to Psalm 23 in verse 6. Thank you for the promise that David made and that the psalm writer made and that we can agree with that, that we will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Thank you for giving us access to your house. Thank you for giving us access to the household of faith. Jesus, thank you for dying on the cross over 2,000 years ago. Thank you for your blood being shed for the forgiveness and the remission of our sins. Thank you for being buried in the tomb. And Jesus, thank you, Holy Spirit, for raising Jesus from the dead. Thank you that we're saved by grace through faith. It's not of our works, Lord, lest we would boast but it's because of the finished work that you've done on Calvary that we have access to your holies of holies. We have access to eternal salvation in the name of Jesus. And Lord, thank you that you have securely placed us in your holy household, that you have securely placed us, Lord, and how we have eternal security in Jesus' name. Lord, that our names are written in the Lamb's book of life and that we can claim this promise with the Psalms that we will dwell in your house forever. Lord, these earthly tabernacles that we are housed in, they're not meant to last forever. Lord, our old man is perishing day by day, but our new man is being renewed day by day. Lord, as we are here in these homes, these, these homes, they may be apartments, they may be townhomes, they may be custom homes, they may be gated communities, Lord, but these homes are not our ultimate home. Lord, we know we have a building not made with hands that are eternal in the heavens. And we thank you for reserving our place in heaven. We thank you for reserving our place in your household. We thank you for being a part of the household of faith. And we thank you, Lord, that we'll dwell in your presence forever. Lord, we look forward to the day when we'll shout and praise you and thank you all day long. And there will be no night in heaven for you, oh Jesus, will be our sun that is shining brighter than a thousand suns. We thank you that we'll live in your house forever. We don't know how long eternity is, Lord, because of our finite minds and our inability to understand it. But we just thank you that there will never be a time where you will ever leave us nor forsake us. There'll never be a time where we won't be able to experience your glory and to experience your truth and your majesty and, and just your splendor, God. So thank you for reserving our place in heaven with you. Help us to be rejoiceful and mindful of that today. Help us to be grateful of your eternal promise of security and our salvation today. We believe victory in the lives of your people. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen.
Hey, man, again, today was day number 20 of us praying 21 days through Psalm 23. And, and um, today we read from Psalm 23, verse 6. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. Amen. We'll be back to close out this prayer series tomorrow. Thank you all for being with me. Uh, share the channel with somebody else. Subscribe to the channel so you can get these daily notifications. We'll be back tomorrow to pray with you and to pray for you. I love you in the Lord. Be victorious. God bless.